Here is yes, but but the ethics the committee doesn't really have the mandate to ask or refer the matter to say uh, pol say police or the CBI. That can be done only after the ethics committee submit its report to the Lok Sabha speaker. Then the view of the parliament is taken. But there is also this question about whether this case should have been sent to the Privilege Committee or the Ethics Committee. On that question, I'll bring in uh, Nalin Kohli. You know, which committee should it be? Because which is the right forum to look into these allegations, Nalin? Either of the two, whether it is to be the Privilege or Committee or the Ethics Committee, that would be decided by the Speaker or the Speaker's office. Let's not forget that the complaint was essentially by a parliamentarian. In this case, the Shikandube. He has sent that uh, complaint based on information that he has received from an advocate. Hmm. That information basically points out that approximately some 60 plus questions were asked by Ms. Mahua Moitra as in her capacity as a parliamentarian. And those questions primarily relate to one particular business group which is the Adani group, almost some 50 odd questions out of 61. So therefore, there is a certain pattern to those questions. What further emerges, and then eventually we have an affidavit to that extent coming from Darshan Hiranandani, pointing out that these there was a sort of a professional meeting at one point between him and Ms. Moitra, wherein thereafter there were demands for, excess, for uh, expensive gifts. Those were complied with, and his business interests seemed to be pursued. In that process. So at the end of the day, when the questions of ethics of a parliamentarian arise, you have to bear in mind she is a people's representative, the representative of people. She is functioning in that capacity as the representative of citizens in parliament. She is using the forum and the floor of House of Parliament to ask questions that are meant to be to serve the interests or the welfare of people at large, the citizens at large, her constituencies or the interests of the country. She or any parliamentarian cannot be asking questions that serve the business or the personal interests of either her or of another individual or a business group. And if that is being used to further a political agenda, which is target the prime minister or target the government by using this personal or business interest in that for a quid for crew, in a sense, in trying to receive some gifts or etc. or developing a relationship based on receiving expensive items, then it is questionable and certainly has to be investigated by one committee or the other. In this case, the ethics committee. Is this what a parliamentarian is supposed to do? The same question came up in 2005 hmm. when the cash for questions was asked. Then there was a camera that saw that parliamentarians were accepting cash the ethics the committee at that time took action within a period of two weeks, recommended their disqualification. Now, Ms. Moitra will have an opportunity to obviously give her version of the story. But the fact of the matter is, till date, there is no version from her side. All there is, is questions being asked about the people who have complained against